The volume of a rectangular prism is length times width times height, so we need to find those three values. Let's write an equation for surface area because we know its value. The top and bottom faces have the same area, as do the front and back and the left and right. Therefore, the surface area is 2 times the area of the top, plus 2 times the area of the right, plus 2 times the area of the front. Since the ratio of the side lengths is 5 to 3 to 1, we can represent the length as 5x, the width as 3x, and the height as x. So the area of the top is 5x times 3x, the right is x times 3x, and the front is 5x times x. Next, we multiply the factors in each term. Now we add them, then divide both sides by 46. Since x equals 6, the length is 30, the width is 18, and the height is 6. Thus, the volume is 30 times 18 times 6, which equals 3,240.